What's going on, guys? This is Andrew's video, and today um, we're gonna be making a new series called Old School Games with Andrew Troop. <laughs> it's called a game. And today we are playing Vetrix. Um, this was an old game from. Made by Dad. Who is it? Made by. Uh, yeah, we got Bruby on his gamer with us here. Go check out his channel in the description. Yeah, what's what's this guy? Vectrex. I don't remember who built it. I. Uh, it's already... like something scientific. Something scientific. I think. That's all we know. It's all. And he died. So basically, what you do in this game is you're kind of in this. Atari Asteroids kind of somewhat relationship game. No, 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 you're saying nothing like that. I don't know. It's, the name of the game is Fortress of Narzad. Fortress of Narzad. And you gotta survive. See how the bullets bounce? Yeah, the bullets can bounce. And you gotta try not to get hit by your own bullets and the enemy bullets. Yeah, this was a really hard game. This game's a lot of fun. So right now we have Bruby on Skater here playing, um, yeah, we got him playing here, and here, you we, may pass, yeah, <laughs> and you shall pass, it's like Gandalf and Lewis guys, you shall pass, yes, are those like birds, yeah, the Vextrex is, is unique because all, all of the graphics are vector graphics, which means that they're made out of lines. Which is pretty cool to have to make. So yeah, we're going to do some fast forwarding here. And you can see us play this game pretty much. Get, get in some levels. And montage time. Now it's game over, and a lot of these old games you can't continue. So you just see, I'm back to level one. I don't think you ever went to level two, dude. But I'm all right, man. Well, there's three phases. Oh, jeez. So you have to pass through three waves, and then you can go through the gate. So there's one phase completed. See, there's two phases completed. And that should be the third phase. There, now I may pass. Level two. Get in the hole. And the one thing, another thing too, is it's hard. I don't think you're going to be able to appreciate just how clean and, and, and good the graphics are. Because the... Uh, there's really no way to record Vectrex that I'm aware of other than putting the uh, the camera to it because the the Vectrex system is not connected to a TV. It's actually its own. It is its own TV. Yeah, and at the end of the video, we do a little review on this game. We talk a little about it and show you the system and stuff in the game. Yeah, we'll show you the cartridge and everything. Yeah, so you can see that it's not really connected in the controller, so... Yeah, there's a little review for oh, all this, and you can see that. This here is the Vetrex. Um, you can see here's a real TV right there. This is its own TV. The controller pops right into the bottom just like that, which is really cool. Um, do that, and you just flip it up. It's really cool. Um, other than that, there's not much to say about this. Um, we can show you the cartridge right now if Dave would kindly get it out. I'm stuck. <laughs> and we jammed it. Yeah, whatever. I'll take it for later. Okay, well, this is the Vectrix cartridge. 
it is very cool. Vetrix was a really cool game. It was it was probably a really old, somewhat 3D game. In GCE. So in, who, oh yeah, and GCE made it. Uh, the other cool thing about Vetrix. Here, okay. All right. So there's no. Here's the cartridge port over here. There's okay, the so cartridge. you notice that there's no cartridge in it. Yes. Watch this. You turn it on, and it's already there. No, wait a minute. Oh, it's got a game built in. Whoa! So even if you buy one without a cartridge, you'll still be able to play it because it has Mindstorm installed on it already. Oh, now, well, look this, at this game. This game is an asteroid clone, but it's it's better than asteroids, in my opinion. <laughs> so yeah, if you do not have a Vetrex, dead. Dead! <laughs> so if you do not have a Vetrix cartridge, um, that's fine because all you really got to do is plop it on and the power buttons are right there. Right there, and then I think this is the yeah. brightness. Yeah, the brightness. Or whatever, I don't know. What it is. It's a reset and an on and off button, and, and it's volume as well. So the off on and off button is the same thing as the volume and there's a reset so yeah if you don't oh, I got it. if you don't have a cartridge oh, that was awesome. there's already a game in there for all you and look at that you gotta appreciate that graphic that's amazing so yeah this is a new series we'll be making a lot now um it has a really cheesy name old school game with Ender Troop, but it's amazing, it's the best thing ever, and yeah, um, we will continue doing this, I don't care how much any of you hate on us, we will continue, because sticks and stones, but, yeah, so guys, hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, leave a comment down below, leave a like, definitely subscribe, I'll see you guys next video, and maybe this would inspire you to get a Vetrex yourself, considering of how cool, it is, and especially I mean, having. That like 18 times already. I know. It's so cool, just especially having its own game installed. It's amazing. So yeah, maybe you can. Maybe you want to buy one after this video. So yeah, we'll see you guys in the next video. Definitely subscribe and like, leave a comment, and yeah, see you guys.